Hello ladies and gentlemen, this is Mr. Addison of Property Hunter Ghana. It has been a while since I posted a video. I am back again and I know you are excited to see me because I'm excited to be back. Uh, I took a little break, kind of a little stress and with work and things like that, sometimes you have to take a break. I am in Afienya, uh, a suburb of Tema, very close to Mishekam area. Uh, this is a six bedroom house. It has a two bed boys quarters and it has an office space that is currently being used or was being used as a, how do you call it, the children's playroom. Fantastic property, I'll take you around, show you everything you need to know about this particular property. It has a one car garage, uh, mostly it, it hasn't been used for a, for a car garage, mostly was used as, as a storage, but it has a one car garage and if you look there is a, a carport uh, probably need, needs to be fixed i will show you some problem in this house i like to be open to people but it, it also means that if there's a problem with the house it means that you have some bargaining power there is a standby generator here in case the light goes off the land is 100 by 100 so it's a little bigger than your usual one plot of land 100 by 100 very nice one and this is your out your outdoor kitchen area the kitchen is just behind that door so this area is more of an outdoor where you come and pound your fufu and do things like that so this is the back of the house there is a dog cage and there are some huge dogs there i think they are in the cage but i don't want to go there you have a two boys quarters there and a bath for your boys quarters lots of poly tanks for uh, water making sure there is running water and you have some out, uh, uh, outdoor kitchen space here to do some outdoor kitchen uh, some outdoor cooking so let's go inside and uh, i like this brick wall this is uh, a glass brick not very common i like how they did it with this one the problem with this house is that it has an issue with uh, damp damping so if you look on the wall you will see some damping marks i think they tried to do some fix but <coughs> excuse me but this is not the best fix for damping if you should buy this house i know some guys who can do a very good job on the damping situation on on the wall and uh, that could easily be fixed it means that you have some bargaining power to negotiate with the owner and get a good price and he's willing to negotiate willing to give you a pretty good price so i just want to take you to the other side of the house before we enter into the house itself so this is the other side of the house and as i told you there is some issue with damping along the wall that needs to be fixed as i said i have some guys who can easily do that very very nicely for you uh, pardon me if i seem to be running through the video because the battery on my on my camera is running down quickly unfortunately it's not at full charge so you have a nice area here for your outdoor sitting very nicely you could put some outdoor sitting chairs here and have a nice view of your garden you could have some barbecue with family and friends very nice meeting here it could be fantastic and if you if you look there you have cct cameras so there are cct cameras all over the house for additional security with uh, uh, how do you call it uh, electric fence and things like that you probably need to complete tiling the the floor here with outdoor tasks and things like that okay so this is your entrance the main gate it's a it's a security gate but you probably need to do some work on it because uh, i think because they weren't living in it for a long time you need to do some touches on the house itself you know put it in the order you want you always, no, uh, no matter the house you buy, usually you always have to put some personal touches on the house when you purchase them. You have a nice uh, glass. These, these are fixed glass here. I'm not sure what they were trying to do in, in, the, in the middle here. Uh, the owner said there was a door there that broke that needs to be uh, uh, refixed or something like that. But fixed glass here, very very it what what it does is that it brings a lot of light into the living area very huge living area double foyer 
and at the top there you could put some chandelier there and you have a very very nice nice view and that is a huge tv and there are some furniture in the house that could be negotiated and added to you have your uh, pantry area uh, initially the owner put a uh, she plays a deep freezer here you know for the deep freezer and uh, those kind of stuff and this is your the laundry you can see that she has a washing machine still in here and that leads to the back of the house and some cabinet space here okay so let's look at the rooms and another view of the the how do you call it the kitchen it's an open kitchen now nowadays not many people want to close their kitchen up you know like to let it remain open and another view of the uh, dining area so you can pass through this corridor into where the rooms are and that corridor leads to the other rooms another view of the the sitting area very, very huge nice sitting area i really like the lighting up there the only thing that's left is a nice long chandelier at the top there makes it complete very very nice one there okay let's 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 look at the room so this first one is what you use as your office and the lady was using it as the children's playroom so you could see that it's decorated for the kids so you have the children's playroom here but in this day of corona you definitely want a space that you could use as an office space you know working from home it's almost a uh, no brainer nowadays you definitely have you need a space where you can work from home and in, in here you have some uh, water damage on the wall and uh, as i said it's damp it's damping the main reason why damping happens on the house most often is that the sun they use for the plastering of the house usually uh, may contain some uh, uh, how do you call it uh, salt so if the sun you use for the plastering contains salt you have an issue with damping and as i said there are guys around who can easily fix that you know they can easily fix that issue and uh, it will go away permanently so the bathroom here have been tapped properly but the sanitary wear in the bathroom has been placed so you probably need to fix that the person is selling the house as it is so you can if you are coming especially if you are coming with cash you can negotiate for a hard bargain and have a good price so as they say cash is king if you are coming with cash i'm sure the man is ready to talk to you to have a very good bargain so this area this is the first bedroom we are going to look at on the ground floor this area you probably have to fix your wardrobe in this space and you have your bath in here uh, i think see, okay this this one has some of the the sanitary wear fix already you have your shower there so you probably need to get a a, a basin here and you'll be complete okay so let's look at the other two rooms there are i told you there are six bedroom I think we've, we've we've looked at one already this is one and this one is the second one and this is the third one on the ground floor so there are three bedroom on the ground floor and three bedroom at the top so six bedroom and all another nice size bedroom so if you have a considerably large family this will be a very good idea for you this is a modern cabinetry here i like the the work the task very nice towers there this the place needs to be completed uh, the throne is here already but your shower needs to be fixed there okay so now we are going to look at the top that's the first floor and you'll see nice family family photos being displayed here very very interesting this is a family oriented person and that's all that's always a good idea so let's take a look at the the first floor or the second level i like the aston lighting along the wall here gives some good character to the walkway very nicely done and then you have your your staircase very very nice with a glass insect very, 
very very nice and it's i think it's double place yes because there was a chart in the house so they had to make sure it's something that uh, is chart proof like the, the child won't trip on it and uh, hurt himself so in the top here you enter a landing where there uh, is a, a family area very spacious family area so you could have either a, a, a pool table or something like that or a game area something where the family can meet and have a good time you know it's always important for family bonding and you have a very nice view of the hall from the top here see that view fantastic view lot of natural light entering the the place here really really like the architecture the design very very nice and before we go to, into the master bed that, that's the master bedroom huge one i think we should take a look at these two bedrooms and what do we have here look at it honey i think you are just right you are just right interesting okay so you have one room on your right i think this was where the kid used to to sleep very nice design for the kid you could see the wardrobe for the kid and things like that you know that's very nice and it has a bath uh, the sanitary wear has even been put in place but everything is ready i think the design here mainly was done for the kid you know very nice okay so let's look at the other bedroom okay. So this bedroom also had a kid team. I think there was another kid here. So you see that the owner, very, very family oriented, did a lot of things to make the kids comfortable. And this is a, a bathtub. It's not a, a jacuzzi, but your regular bathtub. And you definitely want to enjoy a soaking bathtub every now and then. And you have a walk-in closet here this was where the lady used to do her, her prayer so she was it's like, it was like a prayer room for her you could see some you know religious stuff on the wall that's interesting okay so we are going to look at the master bedroom now so you have the master bedroom huge master bedroom look at this size if you want to practice for the uh, 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 Olympics, you can do your practicing here and I'm sure you will win a gold medal. Very huge master bedroom and there is uh, his and her closet. Uh, the light in this one is not uh, working properly but I think the, the controllers for the CT cameras are at the top there. So. This will probably be the man's uh, closet because it's the smallest of the two. Usually the female would like to take the bigger closet. So you have a bigger one here. I'm sure your wife will be happy with you if you should give her this one. Huge master bedroom. Look, look at that. And you could uh, view the cameras from the CCTV on this monitor. So all, the, all the, the monitoring could be done when you are in your bedroom making sure that everything is in order and the bath is here so you have a double vanity and large mirrors they haven't fixed the shower because according to the lady the man wanted her husband wanted a stand-up shower the lady wanted a jacuzzi so they couldn't agree on which one to fix but i like the tile here like a 3D kind of effect. Very nice one here. The throne has already been fixed. Tiles are very high quality. Very, very nicely done. So if you're interested in this property, please give me a call quickly. As I said, the owner is ready to negotiate. And especially if you are coming with cash, he can, you can bargain. I think, okay, the lady has put it on the CT camera. So you see the camera is, I think how many? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. About 14 cameras or so. You, 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 you could even add two more. Every side of the house is captured here. 
and you could uh, monitor it on your phone uh, that's very very interesting so you could see what's happening in the house even when you are you are not at home that's very very good so another view of the living room from the top here very very nice view something that you feel happy and proud to have guests or friends come and visit you so as i said if you're interested please give me a call my name is mr addison don't forget to like the video if it impresses you you have a nice day